Hi guys. Uh, hi guys. Uh, look, there is a special guest. <laughs> anyway, me and Valentina are going to an American restaurant with an Amada. <laughs> and so we thought it would be interesting for you, if you're American in particular, <laughs> to see how an American restaurant looks like in Italy. Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> So the place is called America Graffiti. And as you can see, they really try to recreate the American atmosphere, or at least the idea of America that we have. And the music, it's kind of loud, and there is Elvis playing all the time. <laughs> Toilets have stickers too. Here's the menu, really driving kind of style. Here yeah, the famous mozzarella sticks that we don't have, guys. It's an American invention, okay? Well, uh, spaghetti meatballs. <laughs> <laughs> like spaghetti meatballs and macaroni and cheese. But it's cool to see them in Italy too. The big breakfast, which reminds me of the one of Sbarro. <laughs> Of course, meat is really popular. This one was amazing, but Valentina didn't want to try. One, two, three, four, five burgers. And you can choose the type of bread that you want. So the graffiti one is the classic one, while the Tuscany one is without seeds. And then giant is just bigger, as the noun suggests. Tex-Mex, of course. And they had the Dr. Pepper <laughs> that I only saw in America and Japan too. All their dishes are served with french fries. And then Valentina really wanted to show you <laughs> the sauces. La mayonnaise. And then the ketchup. And something that we didn't know what it was. So Valentina tried. Picante is spicy, as you can imagine. And here what we got. Valentina. Grazie. Guarda quanto chili meat. Che ha un sacco ragguish. Oh. I got the chili one with the meat, while Valentina bacon and cheese. Oh, guarda che bello. And then of course we had to try the sweets. This looks like Greece, like the place where they go to drink in Greece. So I can see where they took their inspiration from. <laughs> allora, we ate there, America Graffiti. I'm dying. I'm yes. so full. Cheesecake was not good. <laughs> it wasn't. Because, I don't know, we, it, like, it didn't taste it like, like cheese. cheese. More like yogurt. Yeah, and like the base wasn't really crunchy, actually yeah. more I mean, when after we went to the Cheesecake Factory or whatever it was, anything in New York, in America, Cheesecake Factory, always, <laughs> forever. No, this one is not good. But the hamburger was not bad. Yeah, it was good. Super oily, <laughs> but good. How it should be. Yeah. And they have a lot of choices, so it's not bad if you want to try. Not too much expensive. Yeah, Daisy gave me her onion. <laughs> and ah, the nice thing was that they divide our addition into... They, they split it already so you don't have to count yeah I mean, maybe yeah, they, they don't have it maybe they notice that we are not the best yeah. with maths anyway <laughs> nah. bye bye <laughs>